Hey guys, Jeff here with That Bold Life, your weekly source for Christian education, motivation, and inspiration. This week, I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. I want to talk to you about my top five favorite Christian podcasts. Between being a husband, a father, a youth pastor, running my own design and web business, doing YouTube, I am a pretty busy individual, so I take in a lot of my content through listening while I'm doing some other activities. So I love podcasts and I love audiobooks because I can listen to them while I'm cleaning or while I'm driving or you know while I'm just living life. I can I can listen to these and be taking in information all the time. So I want to give you my top five favorite Christian podcasts. And these are going to be in no particular order because I really can't rank them. They're all so good. I'm just going to pull it up on my phone. I'm going to look through them. And, and by the way, I use the Overcast app. If you are on an iPhone, I'm not sure if it's on Android. If you're on the iPhone, I highly recommend Overcast. Amazing app. So first off, I've been listening to a lot of Cold Case Christianity podcast, which is by Jay Warner Wallace. He wrote the book Cold Case Christianity, which he was actually an atheist who decided to take on the challenge of disproving the Gospels by looking at the eyewitness accounts and trying to disprove them. In turn, he actually ended up convincing himself that the Gospels were accurate and that Jesus was God. Um, So he has an awesome story. If you haven't read his book, I highly recommend it. I'll link it right here. Uh, It's called Cold Case Christianity. It's a great book. I've actually listened to it on Audible. His podcast is fantastic, especially if you're into apologetics or you're just getting in. He really has some great stuff there. I love that podcast. My second one is another apologetics podcast, but the Ravi Zacharias podcast, uh, which if you haven't heard of Ravi, that's crazy because he's amazing. Just look him up on YouTube. You'll find tons of amazing content. But Ravi Zacharias, he has a podcast, and I think the one I've been listening to is let my people think as the let my people think on oneplace.com is the name of the podcast but it's great it has uh some of his full-length sermons on there so you can just go and listen and just ravi puts out some amazing content dude it's just brilliant um but yeah highly highly recommend listening to ravi uh, a few and i'm just gonna i'm gonna group a couple of these because I love to listen to sermons. I love to listen to other pastors and preachers speak and just teach the word. So a few of them that I really enjoy listening to are number one, Elevation Church podcast. Uh, I know a lot of people don't like Stephen Furtick. I am a huge fan of Stephen. Um, I think he just brings the Bible to life in his teaching. The cheering and stuff that comes with his church can be, not isn't for everyone, but just his preaching alone is is phenomenal. I really love to listen to Stephen Furtick. Another one is Vu Church down in Florida, which is uh, the pastor there is Rich Wilkerson Jr. Um, and just phenomenal, phenomenal teacher of the word. Yeah, he's, I think he's like a third or fourth generation preacher. Um, dude just does an amazing job. Their church is pretty new. He, it was a, it was a young adult, small group, and then he kind of split off and did his own church. Uh, but I just, I love listening to Rich Wilkerson Jr. Uh, he just puts out some great content. Um, his Bible teaching is phenomenal. Uh, another one. Zoe Church in Los Angeles, which is Chad Veach. I think Chad Veach is just another awesome Bible teacher. Um, Then probably my top guy is Judah Smith at City Church. Dude, these are awesome podcasts. You cannot go wrong with any of these. Judah Smith is one of the best communicators I've ever heard, and he will just, he will motivate and inspire you. I I love that dude. I actually got to meet him um, when he came to Tennessee on his recent book tour, so that's cool. And it just, just as awesome a guy in person too. You could really tell he was connected and wanted to talk to you. Timothy Keller is another preacher I highly recommend. He is the pastor at Redeemer Presbyterian Church. Um, dude just opens up the word of God. It's it's brilliant. Um, so those, that's four right there that I highly recommend you just go listen to. Can't go wrong with any of those guys. So, um, so a few other outside of that I highly recommend are The Naked Bible Podcast is awesome if you just want to be taught some scripture. The Bible for normal people is really, really good. Um, They teach kind of theology and doctrine, but on uh, an easier to understand level. Um, Confessions of a high school Bible teacher, same thing. They take some hard questions and they answer it with scripture. Um, Doctrine and devotion. I'm sorry, guys. I said top five. I think I've named like 15. I apologize. But those are just some to get you started. I think all these podcasts are phenomenal. There's there's probably some better ones out there too. So if you have a favorite Christian podcast, do me a favor, go ahead and comment it down below. Say, hey, I love this. Or if you like any of the podcasts I suggested, go and comment that and let me know too. 
All right, guys, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Leave a comment down below. Tell me about your favorite podcast. All right, guys, keep living that bold life.